The Hudson Bay Lowlands are a very unique landform region in Canada. Very sparsely populated, as not much can live in this harsh environment. This region is located in the northern parts of Ontario. It also resides within Manitoba and a little in Quebec. Most of this region is very wet and swampy wetlands. It is very flat as it has been flattened by rolling glaciers over millions of years. Because it's so flat, water has no place to go and it pools and collects and forms these small lakes and streams that daunt the Hudson Bay lowlands. While there are some small forests and marshes along the coast and major rivers, there are some forests in the inland parts of the Hudson Bay lowlands. However, most of the region is covered in peat moss. Some of this region is even covered in permafrost. The Hudson Bay lowlands have a very short and cool summer, while the winters are very long and extremely cold. Most of the region freezes over in this time, especially Hudson Bay itself. The freezing over of Hudson's Bay makes the northern part of this region much colder than the inland parts. The Hudson Bay lowlands also have a very foggy summer and spring with lots and lots of rain. Only the toughest animals can live here. Although many types of birds fly here and lay eggs as the natural wetlands prove to be a very effective nesting ground. For instance, every year thousands upon thousands of snow geese migrate to the area to mate and lay eggs. Another animal that migrates into the Hudson Bay lowlands is the caribou that finishes its long journey from the more northern regions of Canada in the swampy wetlands. In the more inland regions of the Hudson Bay lowlands, you can find otters swimming in the streams along with beavers making their dams. The very rare white fox also calls this region home. Along with black bears, and polar bears. Hudson Bay itself is home to a number of different species of wildlife including the beluga whale, many species of seal, and tons of fish, like lake fish that swim inland, such as trout, or whitefish that can be found and caught in the bay itself. Orcas, or killer whales, have also been found more and more often hunting for food in the bay. The Hudson Bay lowlands have fewer natural resources than some other landform regions, such as oil and natural gas. There are also scattered deposits of valuable minerals, such as zinc, gold, and copper. Lumber is also a resource that is produced in this region, 
as it is cut from the forests in the inland areas. Also, both lake fish and ocean fish are a valuable resource in this region. The population in this region is extremely low. Only 35,000 people live here. In small towns or settlements, But that doesn't stop thousands of people from coming to the Hudson Bay Lowlands every year for camping, cottaging, hunting, or just enjoying the natural beauty.